This is chapter one of Romance Your Writer Within. Invite a conversation. When you meet a person you're attracted to, you usually ask questions so they may start to open up. To develop a relationship with this person, you must listen to what they are saying. Otherwise, they will sense your insecurity and insincerity. Close the door to their heart and turn away. It's the same principle for romancing your writer within. Ask good questions, then listen to what she wants to say. The question why, why write, is a very big one. Because if you don't know your motivation to write, you probably won't get very far. But if you know why, you will create a strong foundation for putting pen to paper. When I was a young woman of 25, I wrote in my journal, I want to write because I want to become a very wise woman and share that wisdom with others. I still refer to that entry when I resist my writing. I want to inspire people, especially women. So in times of resistance or rejection or self-doubt, you too can return to your response to this question and that will fortify you and renew your passion to write. Some of your answers to why write might sound like this. I want to write to tell my stories, to inspire others so they know they can make changes, to allow the crazy wild me to flop onto the page in whatever form it takes. I want to, to write to find out what's really inside of me. I want to have people read my work and hopefully enjoy it, laugh, cry, feel what is inside of them, and be touched. I want to make a contribution to this world. I want to have fun exploring other people's lives in my characters, say in a novel or in a short story. That is really fun when you become another character. I want to inspire readers, touch hearts, open them to remember who they are. I want to go on journeys, inner journeys, blindly, not knowing where I'm going. To appreciate what's around me and express it, sometimes just in poetry. I want to write to trust that what I have to say means something. And I want to write from any mood, any time, anywhere, honoring my soul. I want to tell my story so others get a sense of transcending their own challenges, that by writing they can learn from their own. I write also to enliven myself as well as to empower others. I write to assist my soul's transformation and touch another soul. I write to speak through loved ones I've known, give them voice and learn to understand them better. You know. I want to write through my mom or dear people I've known so that then they will have a voice that they never did. I like to gain entry to portals of deep wisdom and knowledge, to lift off from the mundane and rediscover the poetic realm. I write to say a holy yes to life and try to be my best self. It'd be nice to make some money. Hey, what a, nice, what a novel thought that would be, huh? I want to write because I must. Acknowledge to yourself whether you would have to die if it were denied you to write. This above all, ask yourself in the stillest hour of the night, must I write? And if this should be affirmative, then build your life according to this necessity, said Rainer Maria Rilke. So that's what I do in this whole program, to assist you to write. Here's something I wrote called Why Write? And it just kind of came out of me, and I'd like you to hear this poem. You write to welcome back the magic you have forgotten, to let the doves fly out of the hat. You write to give birth to a brand new character, to be inside another person's skin, to know that person intimately as they appear before you, all shiny and wet on the page. 
You write to see the person you keep hidden, to greet him or her and say, I know you're in there, welcome. You write to put a poultice on your pain and pull it to the surface where you can lance it with your pen. You write to free the beast, to let him roar with unrequited passion and devour raw the meat of ancient dreams. You write because in times of deepest anguish, of highest joy, you try to capture it. In times of solitude, you simply must. You write because you want to know more about yourself, that amazing person who can't even say it to your mirror, but who is yearning to speak out from your soul. So you open up to that place inside, exploring with gentle probes, like a lover. You write because you have something you want to say, and so you mark up a clean white page with delight and the scent of yourself. In this writing, you may touch another who needs to hear those words, who needs to be reminded that his words, her stories also matter because we're all human and we all want to know we're not alone here. You write because it's important, because you want to express. In doing so, you remember who you are. When you write, the guardians of your soul whisper their names, bow before you like elders in a sacred ceremony chanting Namaste. So you offer your thoughts up to the divine and indeed remember, deep inside you, buried so deep you often can't find it, deep inside is a spark and by blowing it onto the page, it ignites and illuminates your own greatness. So now keep on writing and write out your responses to that question, why write? That's it for now. You still can. <music>